5 Keys to Attracting the Life You Want If you want to attract your ultimate life, there are 5 keys you need to know. These 5 keys act as stepstones for attracting and creating the life you want. Let's take a look at each one of these keys in detail so that you can start living the life you've been dreaming of. 1. Know what you want In order to attract the life you want, you first have to know what you want. Your vision should be precise and fleshed out for the best results. Because creating the life you want depends on your knowledge of it. Spend a lot of time uncovering exactly what you want your ultimate life to look like. If you are having trouble discovering what you want, try meditating and journaling. When you use these two tasks together, you get a better idea of what's been bothering you in your life and what you want to change. If you still don't know what you want your ultimate life to look like, consider professional help. A therapist can work with you to create plans and strategies for uncovering your true potential and ultimate goals in life. Therapists can help you enhance your life and attract your desires, even if you aren't suffering from any severe mental disorders or problems. Eventually, you will figure out what you want. Before moving on to step 2, make sure that you are happy with the image of your ultimate life. If you aren't happy with your image, you won't be happy with the results either. 2. Create an action plan. Once you know what you want your ultimate life to look like, it's time to create an action plan. Your action plan is what will turn your dreams into a reality. After all, it isn't enough to know what you want. You must be willing to act in accordance with your wants. The action plan is what will make this happen. The action plan should involve daily goals, weekly goals, monthly milestones, and yearly milestones. By incorporating all these goals and milestones in your action plans, you have something tangible to look forward to. Your plan also must include actionable steps so that you can accomplish your goals. To help you achieve this goal, create an actionable plan in which you specifically list out what activities you are going to do and at what time you are going to do them. Something else you want to incorporate into your action plan is possible triggers that could make you lose focus of your ultimate goals. It's important that you have a plan for whenever these occurrences happen. You want to have a plan for when these events happen so that you continue following your action plan, no matter how discouraged you may feel about it. 3. Let go of things that are holding you. One part of your action plan that you should focus on is bad habits and other things that are holding you back. Only by changing the bad habits into good ones will you be able to live your ultimate life. Many people make the mistake of always carrying around a lot of unnecessary baggage with them whether it be toxic relationships, childhood trauma, or even poor eating habits. Habits that hold you back should be left behind. Although it will be impossible to let go of all things that hold you back at once, start with one item at a time. If you've never let go of items before, start with small things that are tangible and easier to let go of. For example, a gift from an abusive ex is a great place to start. Build up your skills of letting things go. Remember to let go of your own personal traumas, as well as individuals who are not uplifting, helpful, or beneficial in your current life. It's important that you stay firm in this phase, even if you feel guilty or a bit scared. 4. Track your progress and fine-tune your plan. As you go about accomplishing your goals, keep track of your progress. If you are a traditional person, you can track your progress using the classic pen and paper method. For more advanced tracking, you can use apps on your phone instead. It doesn't matter what you use to track your progress, as long as your progress is being tracked. By tracking your progress, you can see what parts of your plan are not working. For example, one of your goals was to go to the gym five days a week. In your initial plan, you scheduled your gym activities for the morning but you find it next to impossible to wake up in time to make these events. Instead of continually missing your gym sessions, change the time so that you are more likely to attend them. It's important that you continue to fine-tune your plan as you improve too. There will never be a point when you should stop fine-tuning your plan. Your goals and vision of your ultimate life will change with you. Fine-tune your plan over and over again so that you are continually striving for more and creating the best life possible. 5. Be persistent. Make sure that you are persistent and dedicated to achieving your ultimate life. Even though you might be very motivated at the moment, there will come times when your motivation is dwindling and you may even want to give up. On the days that you feel down, it's more important than ever to be persistent. Only through persistence will you reach your goals and live the ultimate life you have been dreaming of. Tackle the problem head-on with persistence. Since setbacks and laziness are guaranteed to happen, find ways to keep yourself motivated beforehand. 
If you are a visual person, creating vision boards and visuals are great ways to keep you motivated. That way, you can physically see your dreams and be reminded of what is possible if you just stick to the work. Another way to get motivation is to read books and quotes. There are tons of books about staying motivated, and there are even more quotes on the matter. By having a collection of quotes ready for when you feel down, you can quickly remind yourself about why you are working by picking up the collection. View your failures as opportunities to grow and learn. By doing all these things, you are more likely to be persistent, though the job will still be tough. Living your ultimate life certainly is a challenge. As a result, the process of fine-tuning the plan is ongoing until the end of your life. You will have to work very hard to attract the life you want and maintain your ultimate life. What makes living your ultimate life more challenging is that the process never stops. Instead, your ideal ultimate life will change as you change. Because attracting your desires and living your ultimate life is a long-term task. Take your time, be patient, and be persistent. Following the five tips above can help you create the life you want, but you don't need to make tons of changes overnight. Instead, incorporate these tips into your life gradually so that they are more likely to stick and you are able to get the life you want. If you don't take anything else away from this video, remember that persistence is necessary if you want to live your ultimate life. It begins with knowing what you want, but you then have to have the plan, strength, and abilities to follow through.